So I think, um, everything that's going on right now within the country, within the world, brings us as artists to a new plateau to just really be appreciative of what we have. Um, considering that people are fighting to maintain their homes and keep their homes, and what we do basically adorns people's homes. It's a blessing that we can still be here right now, today, in our this turmoil of what the world has going on, and still be able to give people something to brighten their day. Yeah. Because we provide uh, not a necessity. This is a pure luxury for people. So for people to still come out, support us, stand behind us, uh, see what we have going on, whether they can afford it or not, just to support us and tell us to keep moving forward. It's a blessing because a lot of people, you know, they can't even hold down a, a necessity-driven job. And this is fun for us, but it still works. So I'm just thankful to be here. Yeah. Well, introduce yourself. I mean, I know who you are, but let, let, let the family know. I'm Quentin Abate Elder. Uh, I'm an artist, designer. I'm in the business of art. We manage artists. Um, we do everything we possibly can to educate and promote art amongst our people and bring our, our people up to speed. Other cultures, uh, most most other cultures in the, in the United States and abroad have a much greater understanding and appreciation of art. But our people, you know, unfortunately, we're kind of behind the curve on that. So we do as much as we possibly can to educate people and, and to give them a good product. And who are you here with right now? Uh, myself, Stuart McLean, Gerard Stokes. You want to show us a couple pieces? Come on, too. Check us out. We represent Stuart McLean Gallery. We're out of Atlanta, Georgia. This is some of our works. Uh, we deal with all originals, all of our artists uh, that display work in our gallery. It's all original work. Um, mixed media, anything from acrylic, canvas, pastels, chalk, you name it. We represent over 30 different artists throughout the country and artists that are abroad that still work worldwide. Okay. And, um,. Now you guys are still, you know, the Plain Gallery just signed up to be a sponsor of uh, Black Art in America, which we're extremely excited about that. But you guys are also well known for hosting uh, hosting, hosting a famous event in the A. You want to talk about that real quick? Um, about seven years ago, Stuart and I realized that there was a void in uh, the participation between event coordinators and the artists themselves. In most cases, the event coordinators don't really truly interact with us. Uh, we decided to do something that will bring us as artists together. Because most of the time, we see each other setting up and breaking down. But we don't really, really get a chance to commune and spend a lot of time once we're done with the show. So we decided to do an appreciation part during the National Black Artist Show. Because at that time, you have most of the most influential and relevant artists that are doing work right here, right now, today, in Atlanta, Georgia, at that particular time. So we felt that that was the best way to really convey our message of unity and us staying together and just raising our the creative energy. And we got everybody together under one roof, and it's it's snowballing. They're going ever since. Nice, what's up, man? It's Nice, you, Black Art in America. We out.